So that's one thing I've really loved about being in agriculture is being able to share it with other people. I'm Grant Kohler, this is my son Russ Kohler. We are <clears throat> third three and four generation dairy farmers in Heber Valley. Um, about five years ago, we made a little bit of a change in the fact that now we process our milk. We build a creamery and, and we not only milk the cows, but we take the milk and make wonderful products out of them that we sell, not just locally, but all across the United States. It's been a great thing to be in uh, in the mountains, in a great mountain valley in Utah, to be able to enjoy the outdoors and, and be able to enjoy our family. It's a great opportunity to work with our family and, and enjoy our kids and our grandkids. My great-grandfather in the 1800s immigrated to Utah from Switzerland and immigrated to this valley because the mountains reminded him a lot of home. Uh, a few years ago, I found out that my great-grandfather made cheese in Switzerland, as well as my grandfather made cheese in mid, the Midway Creamery, which I didn't even know existed when I, when I was growing up. It was long before my day, and so it was a great opportunity for us to, to realize that this heritage of being involved in agriculture goes way, way back. It's been really great to be involved in a, in a community where we grew up and know everybody. Being able to move into another section of the industry as far as making cheese and enjoying that part of the industry has been great opportunity for us to be able to hire people, to get people involved in our business and bring people in and let them enjoy some of the things that we are able to enjoy. And that's, that's one of the great things. That's one thing I've really loved about being in agriculture is being able to share it with other people. Well, we really enjoy what we do. We have a passion for, for dairy and we have a passion for what we do and we really want to share that with people. We're actually just gearing up this year to launch a, a new campaign that'll include more agritourism options, some options to get hayride tours of the farm, um, even some hands-on calf feeding experiences, things like that, because we want people to share in what we enjoy, what our passion is all about. And so we're always striving to do that. Currently, we offer tours through the cheese plant on Thursdays, but. Uh, we're going to be expanding that so that people can more enjoy our, our what we enjoy. We are one of the few farm to fork companies in the state of Utah. That means that we produce it and it goes all the way through. We control it until the consumer buys it. That's a big deal to people. Our five-year goal is actually to have robots on the farm. These will be machines that the cows can go into when they want and get milked up to four or five times a day. And it is a, a really non-invasive. The cows are really relaxed. Nobody's pushing them. They have the opportunity when they want to be able to go in and get milked. And, and it's amazing where technology has taken us. All these things are things that make a huge difference in the future of our, of our industry. And, it, and in order to stay viable in the industry, if you don't embrace it, it pretty soon you're way behind and you have a difficult time staying up with the industry. People who are in agriculture are extremely good stewards of the land because they understand that that's what's going to keep them into the future. That's what's going to make Russell's generation be able to enjoy what I enjoy.